Squad. What's, What's up, up Oso Squad? Squad? It's your boy Oso Rob. And your girl Oso Allie. And Jesus, today we back with another video, man. Today, you know, we got a special treat, man. Today, this is my it's treat all about for y'all. It's all about Ali, but I'm testing Ali's hood etiquette, man. But before we test it, man, just know me and Ali definitely came from two different backgrounds, obviously. But we changed for the better, we both. You taught me a lot about a whole other world. This is a perfect match. You right. He, 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 I taught you a lot. You taught me a lot. Yeah. We changed each other. We made it, but it came together so beautifully. But the test is I'm going to be asking her questions about stuff that I think she might not know. But she might know it. I think I, I know. I think you know because you're a little bit gay. You, 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 you're a little bit gangster, lean a little bit. But before we get too far into the video, man, make sure you subscribe to the channel right now, man. Like this video, man. Drop a big Jesus in the comments for me and then drop another one for Adam. June 9th, y'all, we're trying to make it to 100K, man. We only need 20 more K, but if you watch this video after that, just subscribe to the channel, anyway, man. Join the Oso Gang, the Oso Army, the Oso Family, man. Because we love and appreciate every single one of our supporters, man. Do not skip through the video, watch the entire video, because you do not want to miss it, man. Stay active in the comments also, and don't ever feel like you cannot message me on IG at Oso Rob or message Ali. Hi, Oso Ali underscore. Make sure you send a message. I have a little twang on the end of mine. Definitely, we reply to everybody, man. We love and appreciate everybody. But Wait, without further ado, comment down below right now if you think I'm going to pass this little hood etiquette test. I'm gonna do good or you think I'm gonna do bad? Comment down below. Whoever watches the whole video and gets it right, your guest in the comments, screenshot it and send it to me and send it to Ali on IG. And if you get it correct, we're gonna send you something special. Preferably if you have cash up, that'll help also. But if you get it correct, then we'll get it right because obviously we don't know what she's gonna get right right now because we have a Let's get it started. But let's get into it, man. Let's go. This stuff looks ridiculous. Yeah, it looks ridiculous, but you know, it's not. Now, I'm gonna start off simple just to see where you at. You know, I'm gonna just ask you a couple times and just see where you at, you know, because it's, it, it's simple, right? All right, so what does it mean when someone calls you bad? Like you my bad? Your boyfriend and girlfriend. Hmm. So that's, that's actually correct. Okay, now give me a point for that. I need a point for that. I need a point for that. Get you a little point. Put it under my name. No, 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 because these are all the questions right here. I'm gonna give you a point so I can see it live and clear. Oh, okay. Okay, this is Ali's board, man. Y'all see the board? I'm gonna put her, her answers through here. Her, her chewing, I'm gonna get her points right now. I keep saying Wait, that. are they just make questions? They just, I don't know how many questions they They ran. This is coming around. This is not, this is all off the head. I got some items because I thought you might not know, so we're gonna get a try. Okay, what does the term lemon or bubbling mean? If I say I need you a lemon or I need you a bubbling, man, what am I searching for? Well, I don't know why you say. I mean, a lemon is a food, and I don't know what a bubbler is. Mm. A bubbler, like... What? What? Don't say that one. What? What's your guess? The people need to hear it out loud. <laughs> no. Jesus! So do you want to take a strike? Or do you want to be? Yeah, happy? I don't know what that is. A lemon, you're looking for a lemon, like a lemon off a lemon tree, or I don't know. The correct is. answer is a raggedy car. It's just not a raggedy car, but you need a cheap vehicle I never heard to get you from A to B. That's what a bubbler is, man. We all know it, man. Drop in the comments if you know what a lemon or bubbler was, man. Or maybe you call it something else. Whatever you call it, an A to B car, it's a cheap everyday car. Drop in the comments so I can know, but that's an X for Abby, y'all. So we're going to drop an X right here on it. Mm. Mm -hmm. That was a bad question. That was a good question. That was actually a good question. Okay, so you out in public, right? You chilling, you know, you, you vibe, you know, you know. That's what I said, man, you throw. Like throw. That's the word. What does that mean? Like Think now. Your dress is nice. You do that. Give her a hand up for that, man. She did good, man. Hey, look, you right, you right, you did good on that. Nah, I, I can't, I can't even. Bend. I can't hate on you. Now, these are going to be the questions I'm going to pass. Oh, no, no, that was just, that was just the warm-ups. Now, I'm trying to get to the real, to, to, to the real deal. Okay. You ready for this? Yep. Now, first question. I'm going to make this real simple on you. This is a box of cereal. Right. It is. Everybody see it? This is a box of cereal. Everybody see it? I mean, this, this is a simple question. It's good, Eddie. Is this breakfast, lunch, or dinner? Breakfast. Jesus! 
The correct answer is breakfast. What do you all mean? three. This is definitely breakfast, lunch, and no dinner. Way. It's cereal and milk. That's only for breakfast. Listen, man. Who let you eat cereal three days, uh, three times? Who didn't day? let you eat? Is the real question. Talk in the comments if it's breakfast, lunch, or dinner, man, or if it's all three. Come on, man. Talk to me. It's breakfast. It's breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, so now cereal all day. I mean, all day. I, I'm teaching you hood after. Mentally write the note down. Now that's just one. Matter of fact, let me teach you a little more about this. Now when it comes to cereal, right? You know, you at the house, everybody there, y'all chilling. You go get you a nice bowl of cereal, right? right? You get to the fridge and realize ain't no milk left. Mom's right there chilling. What should you do? Your mom's right there. What should you do? Now remember, this is hood etiquette. How old are you? Any age. Well, I would say no, no, not any age. I'm gonna say under 18. You under 18. I would ask her if she can make me something else if I can. Jesus! Is you trying to get to that? You trying to get stuck? Why? You better put some water on that ish kebab. But it's not my fault that there's not milk. The thing about it is, that doesn't matter when it comes to that. You go in there. They gonna grab you by like this, take you to the kitchen, and put some water on it for you. Just water and cereal. Listen, man, I'm, teaching you, you I'm teaching you the ropes. Yeah. Don't I'm, ever make my children do that and don't ever do that. Listen, right. man, I didn't make the rules. I'm just here to You cheated. I'm not cheating. You cheated. So water and cereal. I'm, I'm, I'm taking it easy on you, man. I'm taking it easy on you, okay? Now I'm trying, man. Drop in the comments if I'm taking it easy on y'all. Drop in the comments, man. Send it to my, send it to me on IG, man. And if I'm not, then send it to her IG. Tell her I'm, I'm, I'm going too far. Let's go. Now let's get it, man. Next question. Now we got a wire hanger here. Now this is very simple. This is very simple. Name two things this can be used for. Now this is hood etiquette. Don't forget that. I know this one. It's easy. Yeah. Two things. Two things. A shirt and pants. The shirt now, goes over the top. That's acceptable. Okay. Now I'm trying to give you one hood etiquette thing that you think this can be used for. What would you use this for? We'll just take one. If you can give one thing that can be used for besides clothes, we'll give you the point. And so why hanger now, y'all? Drying clothes. Why would you dry clothes in the hanger? Hey, Jesus! Hey, hey, hold up in that car in the door with the Eliminate door. clothes. You close. You just said hang them in the car. What would you use this for? Hang them outside. Eliminate clothes and hanging stuff. I'm you talking. just said I was close to hanging in the car. Let me give you a hint. You see this? It's a trick you might not know. It's really etiquette now. You know, so you, you know this hangers come apart, right? What would you use this for? How do you do that? So it's hard? It's not. So you mean to tell me this don't bring me back no? You mean you tell me you didn't get no memories of me doing this right here? What is this that you're like standing by? I, I, what are you standing by? I'm showing you right now. What is this hypothetical thing right Drop here? Drop in the comments if you know what I'm doing. Because if you stuck, then you know what I'm doing. <laughs> Got it. You just popped a lock in the car. <laughs> you good. I, now, I, gave you, I never did that in my life. We're going to go that easy. Because you know, I, I gave you the answer. I, I, I showed you how to walk. But just know if you ever end out, Okay, she took the point, y'all. Drop in the comments if she's cheating like always. Blue team, y'all always gonna cheat. I told you what the hanger was used for. Jesus, she didn't know. This, another acceptable answer would have been a basketball game. See, me and my brothers grew up differently, man. Yeah, your Trust brother. Me, when we got put on punishment, we knew what to do. And matter of fact, which leads me to my next one. But first, let me show you how to create the room when you get on punishment. You wanna take these and you just put them at the top of the door and close the door. Ball up some socks and you in the NBA. Trust me. Drop in the comments if you tried it, man. Send me a screenshot of your basketball ring. That's how I know if you're a true supporter. This is bold. Send me a screenshot, y'all. I promise you. We're going to play basketball together. I'm going to send you a video back. Come on. Come All right, now. Oh, 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 we're not even going here yet. I got something for you. Okay. So, you get a choke by your mom, right? Okay. Whether she yell at you or you get a whooping, what's the first thing you do? I'm gonna, You can just give me one thing that you do or two. Give me two things you do. 
when you get to the room and close the door? What's the first or second thing that you do? It depends on what happens to you. No matter. I mean, for me, and she yelled at me. You left I've never gotten a whooping. Okay, so that's different for you. Just take a guess then. If I get yelled at, I'm gonna go and I'm hurt about it, like if she says something to me, I will go over and cry. You cry when they whoop you so they can stop. You don't go to the room and continue to cry. You go to the room and you threaten. No, I would go to the room. I can't wait to get off the house, bro. Oh, I would, you know, you didn't even let me say. I would go to the room, cry, and pack a bag to like run away. You good. Yes, that's acceptable. You pack your bags. You can, I mean, you can silently cut them up. No. <laughs> no, you just leave. Hurt. You feel me? No, you silently cut them up. You say that you're going to leave, and you really don't do nothing. You put a little lunch ball in your backpack. What? You put a See, you was a ball. fancy runaway. We wasn't doing that. You too fancy. Ain't no time for that. You didn't pack food? No, I'm. Window, I'm trying to. I never ran away. I always said, I opened the door. I'm going to run away. Pack it and make it look like it's done outside the door so they see it. And then. Not yet. Yeah. See, see, now you already know. You got to get whooped again. You done opened the door and told them your threat. See? Well, as a boy, my mom had boys. We was getting whooped and we had stopped. Back crying and getting in the room like, they ain't even hurt, bro. Shout out to my mom, I love you, I'm sorry, but that's what we did in the room when you wasn't there. After you whooped the please in the room, like, oh my God. Now, sometimes we would try to not cry, man, just cry, bro, so she can stop, you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna tell y'all the story, man. This one time, my brother, man, he was getting a whoop and he tried to run. This fool jumped head first in the play pen and his legs was in the air like this. She was just, <laughs> I'm like, Jesus. But you had man after man yesterday, you know what I'm saying? I, love, I, miss, I miss my whooping, man. I miss the old days, the world was so bad. Now back to the video. Listen, I'm gonna make this one easy for you, right? Okay, so you're at a public place, man, the mall, the park, wherever, and a guy walks up with you. Can I get a point now? Yeah, you get a point, man. You, you did good. I'm gonna give you a point. Shout out to Adam, you guys, for doing our thing with the hood advocate. Doing our thing with the hood advocate so far, man. She's trying, y'all. We're gonna just get right back. Now, so you at a public place, right? Doesn't matter if it's the mall, a playground, uh, Chuck E. Cheese, anywhere. Okay. Guy walks in with these on, right? He walks in with these on, you know, no biggie. No biggie, right? To the right person. So he walks in with these on. Um, and he gets into an argument. He says, all right, be here when I get back. What should you do? Is he arguing with me? He yeah. argues with somebody else. Well, I probably, if I'm leaving, I won't be there. But if I'm there, I'm still doing something at the mall or the park. If I'm watching kids and they're still playing, I'm still going to be there. Jesus! If somebody wants to their shoe. Just trust me. How are you going to explain? If somebody if you anywhere and somebody come in with these joints right here on and they say, you know what? Be here when I get back. Everybody's in danger. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me. Why? The men yeah. walk in with these on. Man, be here when I get back. Why? Because of his shoes? The man's dangerous. <laughs> these are no. Listen, okay. I'm going to ask you another question. Okay. What is he going to take his shoes off and throw them at everybody or something? Trust like, why me. Are you, oh, why are you parking in the shoes? That's going to be worse than that. Because these is the only certified steppers right here. What? What does that mean? What does he that mean? That's what Whatever. You think it's a game, man. All right, man. Just trust me. If you ever see somebody making threats to anybody on the earth with these on. You're scared. Didn't I just say they were certified steppers? What is a certified stepper? Which leads me to my next question. What is a certified stepper? I just asked you that. I don't know what that is. It's a certified crazy person. Cause he's certified. You know he gonna say it. He not playing with you. What up? He crazy. <laughs> <laughs> he crazy. Listen, man. They come in with that hat like this with these on. You know what? Let me put these on right now. She thinks she thinks it's a game. I'm supposed to be scared of you when you put them on. See, that's the problem. You, ain't, you still ain't learning. Which leads me to my next question. You know what? I'm gonna give you a point just because, just in case I don't see you again, the last thing I did was give you a point. Drop in the comments if I'm a good guy. Because if she sees a line and she keeps playing, we're gonna give her a point. What does their argument have to do with me? 
I'm teaching you right now. Yeah. So what happened? You gotta be out here protecting so, our kids. So basically, they walk in with these shoes. I have to leave. Right? What I'm doing. Everybody must go. Every clear out the crazy. Trust me. You be you leave it. They gonna believe you. Okay. Now I have a belt. Just a random belt. Um, like a stick, a switch. We are gonna call it a switch from outside. Um, this is a top to a cup, just randomly laying there. And a phone cord. Why are you putting them all together? Because what are these items? You just named them. What a belt, you? a phone cord, piece of a branch, and a cup. Okay. But this is hood etiquette. What are these items? You got and these are all, what, what could these items possibly be for? Like all of these items. Like what are these items? What are they? What? If, you, if your mom wanted to use these, what would she do with them? I mean, it's obvious, right? Throw them away. Why would she throw them away? What, what, I mean, what would because she Because this doesn't have the charger box with it. Mm -hmm. This doesn't have the cup with it. You're right. This, she would eat this. I and mean, this is nothing. This is for blowing my fire. Aunt Sharon. Did y'all see what's going on here? These are all weapons. Weapons? You will get whooped with any of these. This is her ass. I told you I didn't have a job I did, so let me tell my story now. Trust me. When you act like you ain't got no sense, this cut, it doesn't matter what's the orange bitch, you getting hit with it, man. You lucky I ain't got a brush, some spray. Wait a minute, I ain't got no money. Because. Jesus, she cheated. You still ain't got no You got whooped with all these before. You think I didn't? <laughs> Why do you get whooped with this? Because that's what was in orange bitch. I would have got whooped with this too. No, that's murder. See, that's what I'm saying. You're not understanding. You're not understanding. You never touch another one with this. None okay. of this. You are. So, I'm going to ask you another time. I'm just going to ask you a time that sounds simple, right? This should be easy. Okay. This should be super easy. I know you're going to do it. Like, I say it, when you say it, I think. What does it mean when somebody say, you trip? You said to me all the time. Yeah. You trip. I believe, I know it's bad. You're acting crazy. You're acting crazy. Yeah, something like that. Like, you trip, man. Like you just, yeah, I mean, that's close. I'm going to give you a point. You already got about 15 points for that. You've you been cheating. I've been cheating. Because he always you cheating. cheating. She always cheating. <clears throat> okay. You good. She, she, been, she been doing good. You, you, you good. You good. You, you been working. Okay. Now I'm gonna ask you something off, off, off the chart. Off the, you know, just, just off the dome. What I know. What I know y'all know. What I know that y'all know. Okay. Okay. In the, in the hood, you know. In my people home. Your people too. You know what I'm saying? Because people don't know what you mean. Right. They, they don't know. I mean, I grew up with my mom though. Yeah, so it ain't the same. But, but, but you got me. No, I got you. Now in every home, you know. It's a, it's a skillet, right? A skillet or a pot. Now, what's in that skillet or that pot? That's easy. Food. Gee! See, she didn't hit you with this switch. Oh, like, right, or it's empty. Like, this is empty. It's not empty. Like, this is for something else. Don't even worry about this. What is in that skillet or pot? No! I mean, is somebody cooking? I feel like you're close, but you're not, you're not hitting what I want you to hit because every person knows this. Everybody knows this. In every skillet or pot that you see in every home in the hood or in, you know, in people's houses, Ooh. they got that skillet or that pot that's not cool. It's not the stove. Mm hmm. Food. Jesus. You're trying to trick me. It's food. I'm not changing my answer. You 3% right. It, okay. I'm You're trying to trick me. I know. I'm not food. tricking you. It's you want me to be specific? Yes. Okay. And, and don't say Brussels sprouts. Chicken, asparagus, just especially if it's a skillet. Drop in the comments, man. And she didn't get a whoop. Like I did. Now we know what's in the pot. It's grease. Oh, grease. Oh, what the heck? That's how I know y'all need so much cauliflower. Yeah, right <laughs> we do eat cauliflower, actually. Okay, you're right. You know what, man? I done taught you about a hood etiquette, man. But I, should I keep going with this hood etiquette, man? Or should I just do a part two? I think I should do a part two on that. That's, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a part two. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I'm gonna come back to this whole edition. Okay, well, this is how we're gonna do it, y'all. If this video get 
5,000 likes. We'll do a hood etiquette part two, man. Drop in the comments. Send me a screenshot, man. Don't forget, man. If you enjoyed this Actually, video. Actually, yeah, I don't mind because as you can see, I did great. I only got three wrong. I'll do yours. You quiz me on something that you think I might not know. Okay. Yeah. So make sure, man, if you need to channel subscribe right now, man. You already know, man. Don't forget. Send me a DM. Send me a DM. We always hope we can talk to all our subscribers. Man. We love and appreciate everybody, man. Subscribe to the channel. We're going to roll to 100K June yeah. 9th. Happy birthday, man. We're going to see y'all next video, man. Peace. Bye.